a lot of men are told that if you're on testosterone replacement therapy, you have to donate blood. But the truth, it's not necessary. And it could backfire. So let's clear something up really quick. There's no medical guideline that says TRT equals mandatory phlebotomy. Now look, donating blood is a great thing to do. It helps people. And bonus, it burns about 500 calories. But here's the deal. Donating blood just to fix your high red blood cell count or your elevated hemoglobin, it's not a real solution. Yes, it will drop your hemoglobin by one to two points and your hematocrit by two to 4%. But guess what? Your body replaces those red blood cells in about a month. Boom, right back where you started. And if you keep donating too often, you risk iron deficiency anemia, which causes fatigue, weakness, brain fog, because it takes your body twice as long to replace the iron as it does red blood cells. So having a slightly elevated hemoglobin and hematocrit or red blood cell count, it does not put you at any increased risk for blood clots, strokes, heart attacks, or whatever you may have heard. There's no need to treat an elevated hemoglobin and hematocrit emergently. There's no need to donate blood when you're on testosterone replacement therapy.